Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I just got off work and I'm going to be doing a realistic nighttime routine. So you'll see exactly what I do after work. So I'm about to run to Walmart. Well, first I think I'm going to get some coffee. But I'm about to run to Walmart to pick up some ingredients for tonight's dinner. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. But I'm going to take y'all along and show y'all what I do once I get off work. Just like I said, I stopped and got my coffee. I got Dunkin'. I got an iced caramel latte with hazelnut syrup in it. But now I'm at Walmart. You can kind of see. Walmart, I'm here to get ingredients. I'm going to make chicken sandwiches, I believe. Some, like, fried chicken sandwiches and some french fries. Just some, like, comfort southern food, I guess you could say. I don't know. But, yeah. So, I'm going to take you inside Walmart with me. So I'm back home now and I'm going to be doing a little bit of cleaning because the house is a mess. After our Florida trip and everything, it just, it looks like a wreck. I don't know. So I need to do some dishes, some sweeping, mopping, all that type of stuff. So this is the whole realistic part of this routine because living out on your own like you gotta you gotta do everything like you do the dishes you do the sweeping the laundry all that so yeah but i'm gonna go ahead and do some of that because i know we got like leaves and everything on the ground but let's start cleaning and even though it is january 12th i still have my christmas tree up but to be fair we didn't put it up until like december 17th so all of our Christmas stuff is still up because I'm celebrating while I can, but I'll probably end up taking it down today. I mean, if you see it in the video, then I took it down, but it's possible that I might keep it up just because I love how it looks. Like, especially this part, like, isn't that so cute? But I don't know. I might end up taking it down just because, but yeah. <laughs> So as you saw, like I took down the Christmas tree, I know I would, but I took down the Christmas tree, I've swept, I've mopped, the dinner is preparing because it's marinating right now. But now I'm gonna take a shower while I wait for that to marinate just a little bit longer. And then as soon as I get out the shower, I'm gonna start doing dinner and everything. But yeah. So I just got out the shower, that's why I'm looking crazy. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you my skincare because that is part of my routine. But in the shower, I wash my face with the CeraVe facial foaming cleanser thing. And then it leaves my mascara looking like this. So then I go in with the Mercellar water. I have the waterproof one, but I, I don't know how I feel about it because it leaves my eyes and like my face all like oily. And I don't like that because then I have to like rewash my face. I mean, with just water, but I don't know. Cause it leaves me all oily, but I use that to take off all the extra mascara that was left over. And once I get all this off, I go into the mini fridge that I got for Christmas and I use the Pond lotion. Yeah, like face lotion, stuff like that, you know. Then I just take like a little bit, I mean, this is a big old bottle, but I just take a little bit and go like, not a lot at all. But I just go like that, right? Wait for it. Leave that on there. Then I get Rose Beauty Oil. 
and then just do little drops where I put the moisturizer. That's what it is, not face lotion, but moisturizer. I don't have like a specific brand for the rose oil or whatever, because this is the only one I've tried out. So I can't like compare it to any other ones and be like, oh, this one's good, this is not good. But yeah. I just do little drops exactly where I put the oil, or not the oil, the moisturizer, and then I rub that in. And that's exactly why I didn't want to use a lot of moisturizer, because you're putting oil like directly on your face. So it would make you too like, you know, too much on your face. And that's honestly it really, like, I don't have a crazy skincare routine. I barely have a skincare routine. But I mean, that's what I do every single time that I shower. Like I'll get out the shower after I wash my face and I'll put lotion and that little rose oil. I'll put that on my face. But any other time I'll just wash my face and put moisturizer. If even moisturizer. I need to get, I need to get more into skincare, but yeah, that's all I got for right now. So let's move on to the hair. So I always let my hair towel dry for a little bit. So as soon as I get out the shower, you know, I'll dry my body and everything. And I'll put my hair in a towel. And I'll just let it towel dry for a little bit. And then I'll take it out and then brush it and then put my little sprays and stuff on there. Because this is what it looks like. Fresh out the towel. And then I'll spray a mixture of the Living Proof Restore Perfecting Spray. It's like a conditioning detangling spray. And then I'll use the Purology Leave-In Conditioner. I don't spray it on like my roots or anywhere close to it. Just because I don't want my hair to end up looking like oily, you know? Truck to the plane, to the truck, truck to the hotel lobby. Me, I go through underground garages, presidential suites on deposit, elevator up to the room, shower up, and then we hit the club. Touchdown, gotta see what's up. Area code in my phone. What numbers do I still have? Who do I know from the past? Hit one, she say she got a man. Hit another one, it goes green. Must have changed foes on the team. Remember when you let me in between? That was 2017. All good, Chuck. And now I'll just do the same thing for the other side. change of plans my boyfriend wants me to go with him to sell some shoes so we're gonna do that so i'm currently waiting in the car for him at the gas station because he's meeting with somebody right there and he's like buying shoes or something for the store but we do this a lot like he'll go and buy shoes sell shoes whatever and he'll just take me with him and i'm just Chilling in the passenger seat, being a little passenger princess. But, yeah. Now I'm just waiting for this little sale to be done. So I go home and cook dinner. Because I still haven't even cooked dinner. And it's already 7.18. So yeah. I'm finally back home. Now it's time to cook dinner. It's like 10.41 right now and I'm ready for bed. I'm tired. I already finished cooking. We ate it. It was good. It was really good in my opinion. And I'm going to take my contacts out, brush my teeth, and then head on to bed. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and call this the end or whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and call this video. But um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I can't wait to see you in the next video.